In this video, I'm going to show you how to count the number of duplicates of each duplicate in Excel. Previously, I've shown you how to count duplicates from a list. And here we have my list of more than 9,000 records. And so what we're going to do is we're going to click in the cell here and we're going to go equals count if. And then we're going to put an opening bracket and we're going to select the value beside us here. And then we are going to go control shift down arrow. And that should get us our entire list. And then we place a comma on that. And then we go back up to the top. And then we select our the value the, in the first value. Okay, and then we close close the brackets. Now before we go uh, press enter, we're going to click on the A2 and we're going to press F4 on our keyboard. And then we're going to click on the other the other end of our range and we're going to click F4 on our keyboard again. And this is going to absolutely reference the range. Okay, now we press enter. Okay, so now to get it to fill up our entire list, what we're going to do is double click the fill handle here. And it's going to take a minute because there's 9,000 records. Okay, so now to count the number for each one of them, how when it, what the occurrence is of them, what we're going to do is we're going to start again with count if. So we're going to go equals count if. And we're going to put opening bracket. And now what we're going to do is we're going to select our A2. And then we're going to place a full colon in here. And, and then we have A2 again. And then we're going to put a comma in there. And then we're going to select A2 one more time. And then we're going to put a closing bracket. Now, to get what we need to do before we press enter is we're going to click in between the A and the 2. And what we're going to do is we're going to put the dollar sign there. And then we're going to press enter. Now we're going to double click on the fill handle one more time to get it to, to fill in. And one more time, it takes us a few minutes. Okay, so now let's go down to the bottom of the list and then we'll be able to uh, see it coming through. So right here, it says that there of um, 130135, there's 60 records or 60 occurrences. And so now it's counting down for you. So this is the 54th, the 55th, 56th, 57th, and all the way down to 60. So you can tell that it's showing you exactly the position or the count of the uh, duplicates in your list. So that's how you count the number of each duplicate in your list. Please subscribe.